biggest gap in the rhyme It's calling out black on black crime I was speaking on hot words of rap can impact lies Raiders route the court with the DOJ indications Race the race promise how whatever race you debated Seems like it's only black cause it's the way that we say it With Nora data coming almost by the day indicating That crime is more based on poverty, delayed education And environment than on any level based in the races Major disgraces deceive us on a labeling basis Say they don't hate us and I believe them Problem is people talking like racism is only burning crosses The right deletion that we're beyond the hate institutional lies of pictures don't exist that we make up races rather than like a feature Check the real estate history when you buy your lease it Research the home loans and out into the 90s Even purely based on race Your families in the crime arenas Then you refer to crime as race on race Case by case If not black on black and plaza inferiority Look I'm not trying to save no face It's just data showing what you're saying is factually incorrect I won't inundate you with numbers and percentages Lyrically but that when the culture's actually disrespect Don't act like Rachel talk is hurting you They keep cutting school funding but approve new prisons to the forest too Hey, so how you gonna say that we're post-racial? So how you gonna say that we're post-racial? So how you gonna say that we're post-racial? Oh, 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 oh. the record. Black Americans are sick of gang violence too. Sick of kids posting visit and saying fights is cool. Wanna give the youth confidence to make nicer moves over groups you accuse of beta race try to do. Spend more time on that than protesting all the cops. Make sure little Marcus isn't posted on the block. Teach him so he's less likely to grow up and get shot. But false equivalence is keep controlling all the talk. It's like positive efforts keep controlling all your thoughts. Just defense mechanisms deflecting conversation. Stop and frisk instead of true social investigation. They don't resist and there won't be illegal suffocation. But like this is when you're pulled over with no provocation. Clearly these are symptoms of a post-racial nation. Judge your rage displayed by a Ferguson protester. Get faced with data and you'll say it's just in that location. People wanna say that we're post-racial, a lie they won't face so You try to talk reality, they turn around and say that conversation is effective Culture starts on getting vitally erected It's all lives matter till it's time to help the helpless Been voting to the not veterans benefits for years Refugees and mentions suddenly the vast need the effort It's like you only keep the bigotry and green protected Hey, so how you gonna say that you're post-racial? So how you gonna say that we're post-racial? Oh. So how you gonna say that we're post-racial? Hey, oh, 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 oh. Hey, so how you gonna say that we're post-racial?
Miss Charlotte Young on the tenor saxophone, and Sue Whitehorn on the bury at the beginning. All of y'all saw that Kobe Schneider on the trombone, uh, Miss McGuire on the, on the trumpet, uh, ladies and gentlemen, and of course, our very distinguished special guest, Kadesh Flo, Kadesh MC. <laughs> 